Hello everyone and welcome to another Mimic Simulator SNMP V3 demonstration. I'm going to demonstrate how you can test the passive fault management mechanism of your NMS using the Mimic Simulator. When a fault or event occurs in a device, for example power outage, link down, interface down, etc., its SNMP agent is normally designed to send a notification to the network operator. In this video, we will use the Mimic Simulator to create such a scenario to test the fault management application associated with SNMP Research's Interpol. For instance, when a network device interface transitions from a link up to a link down state, the device SNMP agent will send out a link down trap as recognition of the fact that one of the configured communication links has failed. With Mimic, we can readily simulate this type of situation by sending a link down trap with or without a link being down. Let's create a link down trap by first clicking onto the agent at 10509 and then click onto the trap from the speed bar. From the generate traps dialog, you can generate traps for a device. Any traps generated by the device will be sent to all configured trap destinations. I will select the SNMP trap object link down. With Mimic, we can send out these types of traps at any frequency as a method to fully test the fault management capabilities of your NMS by manipulating the values fields within the timing region. Click onto the security tab. From here you can specify the SNMP version of the trap PDU and associated security information for the generated trap. I will select SNMP version 3 then enter the security data. We will use no auth no priv definition. Send the trap by clicking OK. From Interpol's network map, observe for the icon color to change for the device at 10509, which indicates that an event has occurred. To analyze this further, let's launch the event browser. To do this, right mouse click the device icon and then select the event console option. Observe for the SNMP v3 link down trap we just sent from Mimic. Typically you can do many things with the event, like sending an email or page to the operator or change something in the device configuration. We will just acknowledge the event now. That will change the icon to the original color. Simply highlight the event and then click on the acknowledge button and then we'll close out the event browser to see the original color of the icon. I hope this demonstration provided you with some insight into SNMP v3 configuration and testing, how you can create a real-life scenario with the Mimic SNMP simulator to test your NMS application. Thanks for watching.